Hello from a part of the country where passion for the game is very real. We're here at Elland Road. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary box, providing expert analysis, is Stuart Robson. And with the atmosphere really building up nicely, we should be in for a terrific contest. It's Leeds United up against Monaco. Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I've played under would always tell us before kickoff, earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. And a look at the starting 11 for Leeds United. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And let's have a look at the Monaco starting lineup. Well, for a while, every played with a 4-4-2, and it can still be a very good system. But it does rely very much on your front two getting the better of their markers, and the wide midfield players being good in 1v1 situations. Let's hope they play it well today. Very much looking forward to this as Monaco get things underway. Trying to really get at the opposition here. A fine reading of the situation. Tyler Adams. Will doubtless be keeping a close eye on Rodrigo given his overall ability. Stuart, what do you think we'll see from him today? Well, four goals in his last three appearances says it all, doesn't it, Derek? He's been absolutely outstanding. He's taken the chances that come his way and he looks a real threat every time he gets the ball. Mbolo and a body in the way. Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Harrison. And Rodrigo has it. Brendan Aronson. Mark Rocca. Rodrigo. Adams. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. He's got the right idea with that pass. Could it be? Galavin, what a save! Keen to take it short here, and that is how to block. Now, how about the short corner? Great block, and that'll be Monaco's throw in. Opportunity to deliver the cross. They could nudge in front, and it should have been the first goal of the game. Well, I can't believe that chance has been squandered. That should have been the opener.
Mark Rocca. And Rodrigo has it. A foul, but advantage played. A move of promise on the flank. Well, that cross was more than acceptable, but they couldn't fire at home. Rodrigo. Well, just the tackle that was needed. Ben Yedder. Alexander Galavin has it. Here's Ben Yedder. Ben Yedder. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Could be a chance to break here. Oh, that's an interesting pass. It could have been awkward for the goalkeeper. Well, just listen to these fans. They're urging their team to score here and take the lead. And deciding to go short with this one. The referee knew that was foul play. Can they forge ahead? Blocked it brilliantly. And there to intervene. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. This looks interesting. Oh, big opportunity. And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. And below, and here's Ben Yedder, opportunity to take the lead. A fine block. Well, he got the touch on the ball, and so a corner it'll be. And the referee will go back now to the earlier incident. Yellow card it is. Well, they're going for the short one. Crossed into the penalty area. Oh, great header. Smart stop, though. A chance now with the corner. Who can they pick out? Well, it all counts for naught. Great pressure to win the ball back. Surely! Oh, the goal was staring him in the face, but he couldn't avail himself of the opportunity, Stuart. Well, he should do better there. Everything was good until the finish. And the referee's whistle, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here in Yorkshire. Well, we thought Rodrigo might figure prominently, but is it working out that way, Stuart? Well, I've been disappointed with him in that first half. He just didn't have an impact on the game. Yes, the service into him wasn't great, but his movement needs to be a lot better. Let's hope he improves in the second half. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Lovely ball over the top. Ben Yedder. Well, he made that interception look routine. In truth, it wasn't. Strauch. Not the best of passes, was it? It'll be a throw. <laughs> Ken
Tremendous intuition to win it back. Might be able to set up the chance. Oh, good defending to stop a decent-looking attack. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Opportunity it is. And a goal! Now they've broken through. 1-0. Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. So, underway again here. 1-0 the score. He's in control of the situation. Yusuf Fofana. And not quite accurate enough, Stuart. Well, I think he should do better there, but at least they're now knocking at the door. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. Well, Leeds aren't controlling the possession here, but when they have had it, they've looked so dangerous, particularly when they press high up the field, win the ball back in those areas, and then counter-attack quickly. It's really good without the ball, and the all-around performance levels have been high. And the flag raised. Offside it is. There has been plenty of limbering up from substitutes. And now both sides will make personnel switches. Rodrigo. Intelligent threaded pass here. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Rodrigo. On the ball, Mark Rocca. And mistimed the run, sadly. That's offside. Time for a change then. Camara. Alexander Galavin has it. Ben Yedder. Real chance. The well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. Galavin. Oh, he could be in trouble here. Well, under those circumstances, any referee would really be put to the test. And in this case, a booking steward. Well, it's a difficult decision, but I'm with the ref here. No red card for me. but the keeper able to turn it away a stunning stop well they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game
Playing it short. The delivery towards the back post. And it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. And possession given away. Oh, that's an interesting pass. Five minutes left. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Ben Yedder. Mohamed Kamara. Well read to put an end to that attack. So three minutes of stoppage time it'll be. Into the advanced position. Brendan Aronson. Oh, that's a well-timed pass. Spectacular save. Top-class goalkeeping. And there goes the final whistle. Job done by Leeds United today. What did you make of it? Well, Derek, they didn't dominate the game by any means today. But overall, they had the better of the chances and just about deserved their win. Well, impossible to ask footballers to produce magic every single game. And it didn't happen for him tonight. Well, I would say he was average today, but he can't be at his best every week. He just did a good job for the team.